Hey, fella. How you doing? Good, man. Good. Good. Good, to see you. Hey, How you doing? Good to see you. Great. Great. Come on in. Right where I was, it's not Folks, we are here with Jeff Davis from Flame Boss. Jeff, so excited and great to have you on the line grill. Be here. Absolutely. Folks, we are getting ready to put some stuff on the grill. We got some exciting news to share with you, some things to show you. But right now, we're going to be seasoning up. We've got a brisket point for burn ins that we're going to be uh, putting on some Lane's Barbecue brisket rub. We've got two tri-tips. One, we're going to be using Code 3 uh, spices. Which one was this? That's the Backdraft. The Backdraft. So Backdraft by Code 3 Spices. Folk, great, great company. Gives back to first responders and, and wounded vets. Uh, so definitely check out Code 3 Spices. Um, and then, of course, we've got another tri-tip that we're going to put some uh, 441 South Fat Henry Classic Rub by Kevin Ward, so we're gonna be doing that as well. All these products, man, Lane's Barbecue, Fat Henry's uh, from 441 South down in Georgia, Code 3 is up in the St. Louis, Missouri area. Uh, great products, you gotta check them out. But right now, we are gonna go ahead, and Jeff, you wanna get that one going? Sure. And uh, we're gonna season these bad boys up with these rubs. And we will be back shortly when we're ready to put them on the big green egg. Folks, we got the big green egg up to about 275 degrees, and so Jeff and I are going to be putting on these two tri-tips and a brisket point this morning. So I'm going to work on putting these on the grill. This is the, the Fat Henry's. Dude, is that the fat side there, right? Yes, sir. All right, so put that up. While I'm doing this, Jeff is going to put meat probes in this meat with the flame boss. Notice uh, how many meat probes we have as well. Yeah, that's gonna, man, we got we got some exciting stuff for folks to talk about. So let's get, there's the two try tips. And now, that one down there. All right. we've got this brisket point. I put that one right there to slide it back towards you. This way? Yep. And we'll make it all oh, fit here. Yeah. That's on there. Good. And he's putting the third meat probe into that brisket point. So we've got the flame boss hooked up and we have a meat probe for each piece of meat. You're wondering maybe, how's that done? Stay tuned and we're gonna tell you. So folks, I, like we said a while ago, we have got the Flame Boss hooked up here with Jeff Davis from Flame Boss. Now, this probably looks familiar to you. This is the Flame Boss 200, right? And this is normally what I use, but as you can tell, it's not hooked up to my egg because Jeff has brought a new toy along with us. But the interesting thing though is, it's not gonna look any different. It looks exactly like the Flame Boss 200. But Jeff, if you don't mind, why don't you tell us what it is we've got. It just has a little bit of a different number on the top. It's got a 300, which the 300 actually has multiple meat probes. So now we have a pit probe and three meat probes. So um, we've got the tri-tips going and the uh, brisket, point. Br brisket point. So we got all those probes in and everything's on the one controller now and you can actually see it all from uh, the controller or when you log in. Right. Man, that's awesome. You've got your computer hooked up over I here. Do. And you can see both the, the pit temp and the three meat temps. So you can monitor um, and and keep track. You know, a lot of folks have been asking and, you know, and look for, you know, wanting something you can keep control of uh, or watch and monitor more than just one meat, you know, wanting multiple meat probes. And, and you guys have done it. And, and what's interesting too, it, it looks like the exact same unit, um, and it, it looks like there's only two probe plug-ins, but what you've done is you've there's a splitter, and somehow, with you guys' technology, it recognizes with that splitter, even the it figures out which one's the pit and which one is in uh, the meat, and then the other Correct. two, which is, in, which is in the meat, which which is just 
amazing. I, it's just that That's is just that, so cool. The engineer side. So. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> you did a good job with that. Yeah, absolutely. So the, uh, you know the beauty of it, like I said, everybody's been asking for multiple probes, and uh, now we've got it. So yeah, and it works. And hopefully, uh, we have this app real soon too. That'll right. be even easier to connect. Man, that is awesome, but, folks. So hey. Maybe you've heard it first here on Blind Grill. Wouldn't that be? That's something. I tell you, man, it is, it's, that's exciting. You're actually the first person to get to see this thing in action. You're right, so. man. That's, that's, it's amazing. And, and uh, it's so cool. So we've, we've got some tri-tips on. We've got the brisket point on. Keeping track of all of it with the upcoming new Flame Boss 300. Uh, so, folks, watch out for that. And, and our, uh, our first 300 owner now. Yeah, man, dude. Hi, brother. Yes, it's awesome. Sir. Awesome, man. I'll tell you what. Glad Absolutely. to be here. So we're having fun. We're going to put Jeff to a little test in a few minutes. And uh, definitely some exciting stuff happening, so stay tuned. <laughs> oh, this uh whole different world isn't it yeah, <laughs> well i tell you yeah, what like you said earlier don't don't walk in front of me i will walk yeah, <laughs> that's right it's fun all right so um so let's uh, see i got your hand so yep. I, got, I found the egg so i'm a that's the great thing about the egg this is why i love the egg man it's what you know 275 you can put your hand on it and you're not leave any skin behind thank goodness <laughs> we're not in florida either that's, so yeah it's, that's uh, right a little bit cooler so, so just don't slide up and touch that cast iron uh, daisy no. wheel so so that's the egg right there um uh, but if uh just kind of be careful as you kind of lower your hands down you can find where you've got maybe that flame boss is you can feel the wires and um and then kind of work your Maybe you can work your way around this direction, around the edge. Right. Here I am knocking stuff over. <laughs> so, just give you a little taste of <laughs> yeah, how I'll, I work my way around. I'll give you credit for uh, figuring all this out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like everybody shut the lights out and, uh, on me, so. You're right. Yeah. Goodness. So, it's uh, it, it makes it a little different. Definitely. So, uh, maybe in a little while we'll... Uh, uh, have you check check on the meat and see how that works? Yeah, and get a, a nice burn mark on my hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! All right, <laughs> sounds great. All Definitely. right, <laughs> cool, sweet. So, folks, I'm here with uh, Jeff Davis, as you know. Um, we've got these two tri tips and a brisket point on the big green egg and the three meat probes from that Flame Boss 300 keeping track of all three pieces of meat. And we have one piece of meat that is ready to come off. We've got a tri-tip that has reached 145 internal. So Jeff, if you wanna go ahead and take it off and put it in here. Get that out without burning my fingers. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, that's gonna be awesome. And then we've got another one that is what you said 130, probably. Yeah, it's uh, 137. 137. So just a few more minutes, we'll pull that other tri-tip off, and we got that brisket going. We'll wrap it probably in another hour and a half or so, um, and then uh, and bring it up to a better temp. But. Uh, We've already had one brisket point, what'd you think? Yeah, it was pretty special. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a little teaser for all this. That's right, that's right. So we're eating good, no doubt about it. So I wanna put this in a cooler and uh, keep it warm for a little bit and uh, be back shortly. We have had an outstanding day with Jeff from Flame Boss. And right now in front of us, we've got a tri-tip that we sliced a little bit. We've got this brisket point we sliced a little bit. You wanna take a test, man? Oh yeah. yeah. I, I, I don't mind taking a test of that. Yeah. Because I have been sampling all day. <laughs> so that's right. Brisket's incredible, again. Yeah, dude, it's so awesome, man. It's, I, and you know, sometimes, I, I was nervous. I'll tell you, to be honest with you. I was nervous having you come, man. But this has been—it's been exciting. You know, you, you you get folks coming, and it's easy for family to say they like what you're cooking. You know, you get somebody like you coming and, and uh, tasting I've seen it. All it's the awesome. Pictures. Yeah, I could about smell it through the screen. So, <laughs> yeah, you maybe but, people uh, want to lick the screen sometimes. So, yeah, uh. <laughs> man, I, I tell you. Um, 
but man, we've got you got some exciting stuff coming out with Flame Boss. Definitely, definitely. So this Flame Boss 300, we got the three probes, meat probes, including the fourth probe for the pit still. So um, man, it's it's coming up soon, guys. You gotta watch out for this. Um, it's it's just awesome. Uh, and some other, we got some other exciting news, man. Flame Boss is gonna be doing some other things coming up, and we're just. I'm excited for you guys. I, I appreciate think it. Everyone's gonna love it. Great I customers like you that help us out. A yeah, way. man, it's you guys make it easy for customers like us. Right. So we well, uh, remember, if it wasn't for you, we wouldn't have a job either. So yeah. uh, we appreciate it. Absolutely, absolutely. So hope you have a safe trip back to yes, back to Florida. And I might take a I'm, block of food back. Hey. To me. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that'd be awesome. That'd yes, be awesome. Sir. So. All right, folks, we appreciate you watching this episode of Blind Grilling. Remember, if you're looking, you ain't cooking.